Hello, y'all. Forgive me for the noise campaigns and loud traffic. It's now 4.48 a.m. I'm not long ago. Uh, I just had to use the bathroom right quick. And I'm still, you know, trying to fight to better myself and trying to stay strong and stuff like that. Um, me trying to survive without selling out or without, you know, committing suicide or anything like that. I'm not going to be one of those people to, um, you know, sell out. I'm fighting so hard against it. They want my soul so bad. Excuse me. So, it's like, I'm, oh, wow. The traffic increases after 430, pretty much. Um... So, you know, I had more things to say, but they slipped my mind. But, um, I had more things to sleep, I mean, to say, but they slipped my mind. But, um, I, I can't believe that people would rather see me out here alone and by myself on the streets and and then you know and they're making these false accusations against me and it's like if something medical happens to me you know it, it'll be very scary for me to have nobody around if i if i you know if nobody's available for medical help not that they want to help us anyway, because they ref they refuse help to real help to us real targeted individuals, and you know try to leave us to die, or anything you know something like that. But um, I'm just in shock and can't believe what's going on, what's happening, and stuff like that. That people advocate that a single disabled targeted individual female deserves to be punished with being on the streets with no food, no money, or nothing like that, you know, and and they over exaggerate, you know, you trying to get help and stuff like that. I'm fighting for and striving for a permanent place. I'm not gonna stop fighting a permanent place and a job and stuff like that, but you know. It seems like in these end times, it seems like the only way that will be granted to you is if you sell out. But it's like, I'm trying to, they're trying to make it like as if it's impossible for you to have housing or something like that without, um, you know, without selling out. So I've been, um, you know, you know, trying to do things to make myself happier. And some targeted individuals say, yes, the best thing is um, entrepreneurship. You know, trying to be an entrepreneur or self-employed. And the perps block that, too. They want to make sure you have no business and make sure you get no sales and make sure you make no money unless you join them. So, um... You know, again, like, why would why why would I want to join an organization where people bully and harass and gang stalk people and think it's funny and stuff? You know, I'm not going to hell with y'all. I'm not. There goes that traffic again. So I'm supposed to be forced, you know, to be back on the streets. And then uh, it's supposed to rain today and tomorrow and Wednesday. And then I guess after Wednesday, it's supposed to be back cold again. So I was asking for hotel room money for to stay off the streets, and, you know, because of hurricanes and cold weather. That's not milking people are trying to scam people are trying to live deliciously. Oh, they're doing too much. 
I, I mean, I hope y'all heard what I was saying, but I, I was saying that um, it's not living deliciously to try to, um, you know, trying to basically survive, just trying to stay away from hurricanes and cold weather. <clears throat> hurricanes cold weather and rainy weather so that's not you know riding a gravy train <clears throat> but it's like these perps need to tell on themselves <clears throat> you know with their crooked schemes they're the ones who come you know if you're a gang stalking perp you you are guilty of murder and you got blood on your hands and, and you are guilty of a felony a felony crime of gang stalking. You know, so if what y'all are doing is honest, why do y'all feel the need to cover up and lie and distort evidence and, and try to hide and, you, you know, I, I don't know. All I know is Y'all repent of your sins, turn away from your wickedness. It's like I'm trying to get closer to God and trying to be better myself, but then they want to falsely accuse me of being fake and playing games when it's actually them. You know, they think it's funny, you know, but y'all won't have the last laugh.